Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back. This is John and welcome to the new episode or new video of uh, our Roblox uh, programming and coding. So today we're going to create how to uh, disable or to remove the, your leader stat. All right, so let's get started. The first thing is uh, click this uh, base plate or plot terrain whatsoever. So next thing is uh, we need go to a uh, server script we need to add uh, we need to add uh, oh sorry script name this one as a main f2 to change and enter all right so remove that one then let's start coding all right so the first thing is you need to uh, connect to the player players that uh, Players added and connect then function then we need to put here player all right then enter then we need to create a variable name uh, leader stat equals to instance we need to create a new one new then yeah put in a folder then players this one's the players no players only player yeah and enter we need to create a uh, name of that uh, that appears in the leaderboard so leader that name equals uh, leader stats all right next is we need to create another variable uh, let's say player points uh, equals to instance yeah well, here as you can see here we're creating a leader stat we're gonna put the name of the player in the leaderboard then the next one is uh, we need to add new uh, elements in the in the leaderboard that's that's a player points new so I this one is uh, integers value so we need to add the uh, leader stat the name of the, the yeah the name of the leader stat name then the next thing is we need to put some name player points that name equals to uh, points let's say points then the value player player points that uh, value equals 10 for example yeah but then so let's uh, run this one and see if it works yeah it works so genealogy this is the leader stat player genealogy and we have a 10 points all right so now what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, disable this one or to uh, remove in the screen right so let's go back then let's go to uh, to starter player here so starter player script so let's add some local script name it to uh, uh, disable ball leader okay leaderboard yeah okay that's too small let's remove this screen enter so disable leaderboard so simple as that what we're gonna do this is the only script this is only just a one line game dot starter this is starter graphical user interface set core this one because uh, core is the, so th these are the things that are available through yeah. set core enabled yeah then enum enum it's a referring to a set of values that we are required to use this to change all right so enum then that uh, player list uh, group core 
let's uh, type core core graphical type then uh, player lease okay then pulse simple as that so this in it uh, if you want to disable your leaderboard this is the this is the only command that you're gonna put in a starter player script then add some script local script here and that's it so let's try and run this one play it's gone right it's gone so let's go back so it works so rename this one let's uh, run let's come back there all right so and that's it so simple as that this is the this is the command you're going to put in the starter player starter player script all right so and i think let's run this one again one more time all right it's gone then oh no it's again oh yeah we, we need to true yeah it appears so you put some poles here yeah as simple as that all right uh, this is john and thank you for watching and see you to the next uh, lesson Bye for now.